All right, we're going to explore marking menus in Maya. Let me create a sphere. I'm going to hit the letter R to scale it up. Now I'm going to hit the letter Q to select the select tool. Now if I move on a polygonal shape and I right mouse button click on the object, I can go to object mode, which we are. I can select an edge, a vertex, a vertex face, a face, and multiple um, component modes. I can go to my UVs. I can select the UVs or I can select the UV shell. So in this case, I'm going to go to face. And if I hold the shift key, I can select multiple faces. Let me deselect that by clicking on the canvas. If I double click, it will select all the faces. If I click on one face and then shift click on another one, I select all the faces in between. If I go to the top and double click at the bottom, I get all of this. If I click on one, then double click on the one adjacent to it, I can select the whole row. Same thing for the vertices. I can select one vertex and then double click on the adjacent and it will select the entire row of vertices. I can use my up and down keys to navigate through the different rows. Same thing if I click on this poly on this vertex If I select on the vertex, I can use my arrow keys to navigate through the other vertexes. If I, for example, select a face and I hold the shift key and right click, I get another context sensitive marking menu where I can extrude my face. I can do a multi-cut, I can wedge a face, paint selection, merge the faces to the center, poke a face, bevel a face, and I can reverse, propagate, conform, or toggle my face normals displays on and off.